It is Monday. That means it's time for another 20-minute challenge, uh, meal challenge. And joining us to try and outcook the clock with a delicious breakfast dish, Chef Trevor Ross of the soon-to-be-open restaurant called Star Belly. Welcome. Yes, thank you. Thanks for having me. And welcome to Calgary. So you moved to Calgary specifically to open this restaurant called Star Belly. Yep. Uh, so tell us about it. All right. So I was uh, doing some traveling and uh, eating in different restaurants, different cities, and volunteering in restaurants. And just so happened I was volunteering at Rouge and... Uh, the chef there knew the owners that was opening this really amazing restaurant that's uh, happening in about four to six weeks and I just got the right place at the right time and they wanted me to move here and help them launch a brand new restaurant so that's what I'm doing. And so let's talk about the area because it's it's not downtown but it's sort of what they're calling the new downtown. Of yeah so basically it's like 25 minutes outside of downtown but there's all these uh, small communities out there that have popped up in the last few years and uh, where we're located is right by the new hospital. Right. And it's this area that they're not really letting chain restaurants in or mm -hmm. chain uh, grocery stores or anything like that. They're really trying to create like a new downtown core. Right. So that all those people don't have to drive all the way downtown for a really good meal. Okay, so you guys are on the cutting edge, and I'm sure the rush is really on for you, getting ready yeah. four to six yeah, weeks out. Yeah, it's crunch time. It is crunch time, but uh, in anticipation of that, you're also participating in something called the Copper Kettle Derby. Tell us yes. about that. So uh, we have a really good relationship with Big Rock, and uh, they picked six chefs out of the city to team up with their brewmasters and create their own flavor of beer. And then uh, what they have to do then is create a dish that is paired with that beer, and there's a competition on Wednesday where we'll all put out our food, put out our beer, and it's up to the guests to tell us what's up. Okay, which one's best. So you can't buy tickets, but you can get them. You can win them. So they're doing social media giveaways. Uh, I'm not sure when exactly. you got to check out their website, check out Facebook, but uh, there's lots of tickets that are being given away, and it's going to be an amazing event. Okay, so that's on Big Rock's um, site, or check out their Facebook page and sure. their, uh, their yeah. Twitter feed. Okay, so we're going to let you get started. First of all, tell us what you're preparing this morning. Okay, so what I'm going to do is, for the Big Rock event, I'm making what's like a, basically a root beer donut. So root beer has a bunch of major ingredients. Uh, sassafras root is the you know main ingredient. It's the right. sarsaparilla root. Yep. Uh, and then wintergreen is a leaf that goes in there that gives it that unique flavor mm. that you can't really identify. But to go with that, we also have all these spices that I put into my donuts uh, that come from the root beer. And that's not my flavor combination. That's a classic one. Uh, it's cinnamon, vanilla, nutmeg, uh, star anise and clove. Delicious. So today what we're gonna do, we're not making donuts, we're gonna actually make French toast. Perfect. And we're gonna make a caramel glaze that is tasting like root beer, and we're gonna make a sugar that goes on the French toast that has those spices in it. Okay, and you say this can be done in 20 minutes? It's gonna be done in 20 minutes. All right, we're gonna call in uh, Johnny Reed, our floor director this morning, and he's going to set you off and 20 minutes on the clock. So time to go. Time to go. I'll just ask you a little bit as we go, but, All right. but get started because I, I don't want to put you behind. Okay, so the very first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to make the sugar. All right? And yes. I'm using fresh spices today. I've got uh, cloves. I've got cinnamon. We're going to throw right in there. Oh, wow. It's going to be ground right up. I've got the nutmeg right here. Okay. And all these the flavors meal, yeah. are in root beer, but you can't identify them specifically because right. it's a it's a whole combination. And then star anise, which is one that a lot of people don't really know about. Right. Okay? So I'm going to blend this all together. Okay. And this is going to be the spice, the sugar that we use in the batter that we put the French toast in. Okay. And we're going to dust it afterwards. It smells delicious from here. Okay. So we're going to let uh, Chef Trevor just uh, keep on going. 19 minutes on the clock and counting. Um, and links to uh, all of these websites on our website, breakfasttelevision.ca. Dave, it's, uh, it might get loud here. So. Here we <laughs> go. I want to get in there. As long oh. as it continues to smell good. We're at eight, <laughs> it is getting loud.